Yo, what's up? Welcome back to the shop. In this video, I'm going to show you how I keep from bluing the tips on scissors when I'm sharpening them on the twice as sharp. Yeah, the twice as sharp is hands down my favorite tool for sharpening scissors because primarily scissors often need a lot of grinding because the bevels are pretty big and sometimes they're beat up. Um, so the advantage there is to use a grinding wheel. The disadvantage of using a dry grinding wheel is that it can put a lot of heat into the metal and we run the risk of bluing the tips when we're sharpening them on the twice as sharp. So to keep from bluing the tips on scissors on the twice as sharp, we do all the normal things like don't grind, don't push too hard, don't spend too much time on the wheel, feel the tips when you're coming off the wheel, take time off the wheel, dip them in water if you have to. But one way to save a bunch of time is to use the tap tap trick. I first discovered the tap tap trick while sharpening saw chain where sometimes you have to take off a bunch of metal and you don't want to overheat the tooth and you don't have a CBN wheel yet. So you tap 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 your way down the tooth until you uh, get as much material removed as you need it. This technique also works for the tips on scissors. I have an old school model A1 twice as sharp here which speaks to the quality of these. On the main grinding wheel, I've replaced the white, the standard white wheel with a CBN wheel. You can see an earlier video that I've done on YouTube about that wheel if you're interested. But a lot of times, I also, then on the honing wheel, uh, I just want to point out that uh, this wheel can also dump a lot of heat into the tips. And it's one that we also need to pay particular attention to. And my last little hot tip addendum here is that you can do those little tiny scissors, whether they're like those little sewing thread snips, or in this case, these scissors on Swiss Army knives or on a Leatherman. You don't have to start on the main grinding wheel. You can do all the work on the honing wheel, but same thing, do the tap tap trick because those are really small and you can overheat them really quickly. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video on using the tap tap trick to keep your scissors from bluing at the tips on the twice as sharp scissor sharpener. Make sure you subscribe, leave a comment, say hello, and I'll see you next week for the next Hot Tip Tuesday. Yo, if you made it this far, thank you. And here's another little bonus for you. When you're sharpening at such an angle that you can't see the bevel, you just use your sharpie to put a little mark on the flat side of the scissors so you know where to cut in on the grinding wheel.